Hey guys, what's going on? It's Max here, and today I'm bringing you guys another Diarize Tips and Tricks video, and today I'm going to be going over how to have no fall damage on the elevators in Diarize, and also how to build the trample steam faster, just because uh, it, this involves using the trample steam on the elevators, so I'm just going to be showing you guys real quick how to build the trample steam faster. It's a lot faster than you normally do it. Uh, instead of taking four trips, as you know, you have to take a part, go all the way down, build it, go up the quick revive elevator, and then do the same thing four times. All you have to do is you have to find two parts, pick up one, and then go over to the next one and slowly move. As you can see, I just slowly moving and I'm tapping X multiple times in a row and I'm just constantly bringing these two parts and I'm slowly bringing them and then all you have to do is I have to take two trips instead of four so it's much faster you just bring the two parts down with you as you fall off the ledge onto the trample steam place and you build the two parts and you go back up and do the same thing so it's much faster than normally doing it and that's how you build the trample steam a lot faster so now uh, on to getting no fall damage on the elevators so basically what you have to do is you have to have the trample steam out and uh, what you want to do is you want to hold it out while the elevator uh, one of the elevators is about to go down it's uh, going to go down but it's on the level where it's right there you can get right onto it as you can see there so I'm holding it and right as it's about to go down you want to just press it down, press down the right trigger, and let it go down. So that way, right when it's about to go down, you let it go, and it's like kind of floating in air. You see it there. You want to get right on the ledge right before you fall off onto the elevator. You want to just press right trigger so that way that once you press right trigger, it's kind of floating in midair as the elevator is going down. So this is actually kind of risky to try and jump down there and land on it. It could Cook, uh, took me a couple times to actually land it and make sure I didn't fall and kill myself. It's hard to see it because of all the fog. Uh, it's really hard to jump down all the way and land on it, but uh, practicing will definitely make you a lot better. As you can see, I landed this uh, just from a short distance and uh, it definitely saves you. Uh, no fall damage whatsoever. You just Once you jump onto it, it flings you back up and uh, you just get a, a little bit of damage. You don't really die whatsoever. Don't get really damaged whatsoever. So it's a pretty sweet trick, as you can see, if you're getting tra uh, about to get trapped by zombies or you just need to get down there quick, you don't feel like waiting for the elevators, you just jump down there and uh, it's really helpful along with the other elevator trick where you can just quickly jump down off the ledge and just double tap A. So this is another sweet trick to help you guys out in getting down the elevators faster. Uh, so that's pretty much it guys if you have any questions or suggestions in the comment section below I'd really appreciate that leave a like if you did enjoy subscribe if you're new and I'm signing out peace